What up fam and welcome back to our channel. I'm Deb and I'm Jack. And before we get to Monday, make sure you subscribe and hit that bell to be notified. We drop good, wonderful eats like these. Welcome back, it's such a treat. Grab your plate fam, come on, let's eat. So we've been doing a really good job on getting the videos to 1K likes. Mm -hmm. So please, thumbs up the video and if you have not subscribed, go ahead and turn that gray button red, well that red button gray. Right. Yes. We don't want you to go backwards. Please. We want you to turn that red button gray <laughs> and subscribe to us and join us on the Fritz family today. Mm -hmm. So, shall we pray? Lord, thank you for the food. Thank you for the hands that prepared the food. Thank you for everyone joining us here today. We pray that you continue to bless them just as much as you bless us. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 We get hungry. Yes. What and we, we have eat? a nice array of things. Mm -hmm. We have a local restaurant called Firebirds. Steakhouse. It is a steakhouse. Mm -hmm. Yes. So I got some steak and salmon and a load of baked potato. Bay, what you got? And you got you some mushrooms also. Mm -hmm. good. Some Don't mushrooms. forget about them down there. I did forget. What you got? I've there? got the dinner of the meatloaf mm -hmm. with a side of Yukon gold mashed, mashed potatoes. potatoes. Okay. And then I've got a chicken with my double sided mashed potatoes and it's a sauce that goes over the chicken. It's a mushroom. And we got some bread down here too. Oh, you got some mushrooms too. Yes. How y'all doing? What y'all eating on? Let us know down below. My uh, mouth is watering. Yes. This is our first time eating today. We out running errands. But we on a date. We in the food <laughs> we didn't figure out who was taking who. <clears throat> no, I was checking you. But we just did what supposed to play. We're when together. <laughs> We're together so much, guys. When we came out and we decided to go on a date, we're like, so who's taking who out? <laughs> I don't know. We'll just rock, paper, scissors for who it was. Right. So I said, well, I call the babysitter. Well, I call Grandma Nene. So, I say, I'm taking you on a date. Just someone call for the baby too. And I can, I can take that. <laughs> because honestly, in the grand scheme of things, it doesn't matter who takes who. Mm -mm. As long as we're both active participants. Mm -hmm. But sometimes, it does kind of feel good to not always do the taking and to yeah. get taken somewhere sometimes. I think sometimes people forget when they get complacent. Mm -hmm. Well, complacency not only makes people forget, but it kind of makes them turn an unintentional blind eye. Mm-hmm. For me, looks good. That's why I got the dinner so I can share some with you. <laughs> We haven't been to this restaurant in a long time. And we used to go. We love their mushrooms. Their mushrooms are so good. And their wings, they have um, a wing appetizer. Oh yeah, I couldn't remember what else we got that was good. But it's we know we good. do eat quite a bit of chicken, so I say you know what, we'll give you guys a break chicken on break. <laughs> I like, we we'll still got a little piece of chicken. But it's not a chicken wing, are you? Yeah. Grill. Chicken. Let me bring my plate up. I'm trying to hold but, mine up. It's heavy. Oh no, I just realized that mine wasn't in the frame. <laughs> and being cognizant of some people who like to see food to yeah. plate mouth. Some stuff really don't be a hassle to do. It's just you got. Think some, about it. Yep. Mm -hmm. Because that's something small, nothing major to do, nor get annoyed. If someone says I can't see your plate, at least with me. Because it is. 
and eating shelter. Now, sometimes it can be tedious to show a plate, especially we have a massive array of food. Heavy. Like we did at 20 pound crawfish boil. Technically, our plates were on the side. We ate our entire plate and then we ate inward. Yeah. That's why the pile looked like that. Because we had to pull it all out. Because Bay was on the sideline. What else y'all been saying? I can't remember. Me and Bubba my gun made forget. Mm -hmm. lost in your toe, Ain't the food good? Oh yeah, slap. I would say technically, Grandma need not babysitting. Cause she been missing them. Yes, but. Cause she been saying she wanna come sit with them. But for me, I. She when you say, just put us out. She told me five times to get out. But for me, when you say babysitter, I'm just thinking that you're letting them know where the kids Adult are. watching the kids. Yep. Mm -hmm. So that we kind of save someone time on asking. But. Sick as matter, y'all. You can't, you can't get that kind of time back. Ooh, what I had on my chin. Probably some food. And we have not been on a date in a minute by ourselves but we have not been on a date since valentine's day wow. we've had at least one kid with us am i tripping we have not been alone like this mm -mm. We definitely needed this. Y'all nephews been tripping. They're growing up being boys. I was gonna say But they've been tripping. Not necessarily tripping, <laughs> but. I'm trying to save them. Being kids. Mm hmm. To you, to what? me, they've been tripping. Because they ain't been listening to me. They got some respect on your name. When they want them. They're finna get some respect on mine. I say when they want them. <laughs> kids, kids, their minds a lot of the times be in the moment. Mm -hmm. you, gotta, you gotta remind them of which moment that they're in. My moment. I'm just looking at some interesting looking stuff. Tell them later what it is. What is that? Mm, what is that? <laughs> what do you got the receipt in there? Does that sound like something you'll eat? Yeah. Sound. I don't want to say Mexican y, but one of those. Hispanic lady? Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, like good. a taco chicken. <laughs> Ooh, that's good, good. I should have gotten dinner. Well, no. I can share the meal with you. This is good. Jeez. Well, this is good. Ooh. My food is definitely good. I've been wanting a steak and baked potato. You have got to try this. Okay. Man. So, with us having all boys, all the little boys <laughs> have clothes, and Aiden and Andrews, <laughs> <laughs> Aiden and Andrews, Aiden and Andrew, 
are growing up. So I know. Uh, clothes. Yep. We gotta. There are. And so even though there's a lot of new clothes, there are no hand me downs for them. Mm -hmm. We gotta go. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, that's why we out. I'm talking about y'all, like. But you just stop. Oh, like weeds. Yes, and because it just stopped being chilly, they only had like jeans and long sleeve shirts. They literally have no clothes. Like, we can't go nowhere until we go buy some clothes. So they stayed the same size and then they just jumped. Yes. Oh, wait, let me taste some water. Give you a straw. I said we have 500. Mm -hmm. Sam's or Costco. Save on the restaurant just in case they forget. Hi. Yeah, it is good. I want to say like a pasta sauce. Mm-hmm. It's just missing the noodles. Right. The chicken's good, too. Mm-hmm. Nice and moist, and that's chicken breast. You like they flattened it. Or I probably got one of the big ones cut in half. Mm-hmm. It Even tenderized a little bit. What like quarters? Mm-hmm. And they probably did maybe a little tenderizer. Yeah. That's pretty good though. I squoze my lemon in there. If you got we free, we don't know what to do with that too. You feel what? I said we free, we don't know what to do with <laughs> that too. Get some food gonna always be on the on the on the uh, menu yeah. or the plate. Food. Because we enjoy food with foodies. Uh -huh. Excuse me. I had the craziest experience with our auto insurance carrier today. Man, I'm talking about crazy. And it was funny because you were sure, like, uh -uh, they're not talking to me. I was sure it was on the other end and mm -hmm. not the bank's end. Our car people text us and was like, So your insurance has been canceled. They like, uh-uh. <laughs> I just talked to someone on Thursday mm -hmm. after I got my allergy shots. So I know you're lying. Walking back to the car from the VA and I got rained out on. So I'm walking to have to run on the phone making this payment. So I can tell you exactly when the payment is. Mm -hmm. Exactly when the phone call is. The 13 minute phone call is that. So I get this representative. And I tell you when he picked up the phone, he sounds so lackadaisical about what was going on. Like, what, what you want me to do about, about it? it? Mm -hmm. And I've never experienced that with USAA. Like this guy tells me that, and I'm trying to explain to him in the state that we live in, I don't know how it is with, where you are, but our state, they have a notification system to where the instant that your policy lapses, it goes to state and there's a, there's a ticket put on your tag. Mm -hmm. Or fee. For or whatever. even a one day lapse in coverage. So I'm explaining this to him because he says that the policy was canceled out at pretty much 1201 today so I'm letting him know excuse me if I can't get this kind of result I'm trying to find out right, is there a payment pending 
what's going on before I have to go ahead and get other insurance because at this point I cannot afford to wait because this guy has the balls to tell me mm -hmm. oh well my manager is off on the weekends so they'll probably listen to the call sometime next week mm -hmm. and you you should get um, a resolution within five to ten days and we can void out the cancellation and once we void out the cancellation then you won't have to worry about that lapse in coverage but that does me no good in the interim because while i can't drive my car without no insurance now i have a ticket on my is you crazy you ain't even say wait till monday and you said sometime next just week. because you're probably lazy and trying to run your numbers up well if you want to um if you want to have a handle today and you want to wait that long then you're just gonna have to pay the cancellation um, the cancellation total which is your entire six month policy now take in mind our policy just renewed like this was the first payment on our six month policy nah G I ain't finna give you $1800 a day <laughs> are you crazy and that's with okay, reinstatement bye. fee plus still having a $600 balance nah homie So, but when I told, when I was telling Bay, kind of like where I was at my wits end with the call, and where I was done with it, she said, when he asked you who you bank with, I said, that was it for me. What rhythm? Our car insurance. I bank with you. It's through our bank. And when you picked up the phone, the first thing that you said is, Hello, Corporal. You came through the system. Fully verified. <laughs> oh. Okay. How sweet. <coughs> okay. And I that just didn't fun, have man. the mental capacity so and space to call back. Because I don't have the time to play. I need some vamos measurements. And to top that off, the icing on the cake was saying every time something go on, it's for a reason. No point in complaining. Just fire all the insurance because it's not like mm -hmm. we've been months and months without insurance, so it's not gonna be difficult to find other insurance. So go to shopping around not only do we find cheaper insurance but we find insurance that has more perks and benefits offered at a lower rate customer service people used to care like you used to be able to say okay I'm just gonna cancel. And you be like, no, no, wait. I'll work with you. They be like, okay, bye. Now, take in mind, when I <laughs> called in on Thursday, have a nice day. It was to pay two months premium. So, you telling me that you trying to run it up that much to where you gonna tell me, oh, well, pretty much is already canceled. So, mm -hmm. we're gonna have to wait for my, because I ain't got that authority. Put me through who got the authority then. But you acting like you pretty much the highest person in power in there today. That's what I was thinking about. So if you can't help me, me okay, why are you not afford to meet somebody who can help me when I'm telling you that I need to know, yay or nay, whether or not my policy you is on the wait. open up day. Wait on it, bro. Wait five days for my mantra. Mm -hmm. You got me back. But the new policy, um, the rental reimbursement, the um, body damage, the liability, 
the medical coverage, everything has at least like a hundred percent increase on our coverage that we have with paying about at that point with, with up and everything coverage is 120 bucks less so we still get a 30 percent discount on Bye -bye our rate me. Uh -huh. peace i ain't gotta stay where i ain't apparently want it look at that lady y'all boy i'm probably because you are we sitting in front well, across the street from uh well, across the Ross. lot from Ross when I tell you I done seen two women come out with some like bar stool type chairs. Oh that ain't no oh them end tables, it's a mirror on there. There's a mirror on that baby. And she got two on baby, we finna go up in here. Oh the camera finna go out. Mm. Baby, we about to go up in here. Let me get my strength up. Mm -hmm. You ain't almost like a fool school. I got a treat, Daddy. Coco T said I should call you Papa Bear. I mean, I pop Papa Bear, Papa Bay. I thought like it. Papa Bear. I'm like, yeah, I like that. Who we said it was supposed to be? Oh, Sir Bay. So I said, mm. Sir Bay is gonna be. Papa Bear. It was supposed to be Daddy Bay at first. Papa Bay. That's too long. Yes. Why does it? Cause the Papa. Well, Papa, Daddy, same thing. <laughs> also. Also, Bay. Just also. Oh. That means bear in Spanish. Also. Mm. So, just saying, also, it's like saying Big Bear. Get this salmon. It's good. I don't want to eat the whole thing. I try, Pete. It's pretty good. I should have broke it. And I squeezed the lemon pulp on it because I squeezed the lemon Ooh. in there. It's good, ain't it? I'm you want your meatloaf, too. I don't really like meatloaf. But I'll taste it because you how are we gonna get food to split and we both like mm, mm. you can keep it. Mm. No, I don't like that. Too far away. Um. Uh, well, you're looking for the tomato. Yep. <laughs> when you said it, because looking at that, that's like. Salisbury Beer. State. <laughs> so that's exactly what it's giving me. So when you just said meatloaf, it was like, eh. <laughs> even though I saw what it looked like when I, I guess like when I tasted it, I ain't processing it like that's not meatloaf. But like, um, mm -mm. they but they should stick to the steaks. Um, no shade. It's not giving me nothing. What's it giving you? <laughs> a tad bit of brown. A tad bit of brown gravy. Mm -hmm. I need some more Mustard gravy. for texture. I need some more gravy. Now I think that's, that's what it is. Because it just straight tastes like meat. <laughs> Just not sauce. I was gonna say you heard your, me say your other one was um, uh more saucy. Did not. It's yeah, this end. They they gave him the butt it low. The end. It ain't flat. Oh yep, yeah, they gave you the butt low. Yes. You wanna taste my steak? Sure. With the steak sauce or without? I'm close my eyes. I'm gonna just burn. I, I definitely want to let you taste the pink part. Got my little potato bite ready right here. Okay. I don't want to hold it under your hairs. I don't want the hairs to pop. Oh, wow. <laughs> I'm so weak. You so funny. <laughs> you said, oh, wow. I didn't say, oh, wow, when I made that. <laughs> you want some more? You want another bite? 
You got more potatoes. That is decadent. I'm talking about it is. It's good. It's tender. Oh, wow. Yeah. That was, that was, oh, that's what I was going to tell them. I know they're like, why the hell she ain't bite? I mean, I uh, bite. Cut the steak. Because we in the car with plastic utensils. I was going to say that, yeah, the, um, the why wasn't that the flavor just blew me out the water. The texture mm -hmm. blew me out the water because it was like melting. Mm -hmm. That's what I said. I gotta I got let you bite the pink part. That's my favorite. That salmon was good though. You need to get a surfing chair. So after Ross, we'll dip back in for some dessert with you guys. But we gotta figure that out. That's also what I'm about to say. I ain't never did this before. Where do y'all buy y'all boys' clothes from? Oh. I mean, everything been kind of easy because it's been all little cute stuff. We've been going to Carter's and Walmart, you know, Target stuff like but that. But they, they get, yeah, they get grown. Yeah, they boys. Like, they getting grown. They need some. <laughs> and I know it is summertime, so of course we can get them some basketball shorts. Yeah, there's a lot of people in these sizes. And stuff like that. Yeah, it feel like everywhere we go, they ain't got no sizes. But other than like the, the children's place. I'm finna go in this Ross. Oh, uh, we're here for Target. Us Rosies. Mm hmm. Yeah, that's what my, my grandma said, Rosies. Um. And what else? Well, depending on what side of town, TJ Maxx, Maxwell. Yeah. Way. Then, you know what else I'm thinking about? So, we've been dressing them like as twins. Or buying them two of everything mm -hmm. so like did we stop now they haven't complained i think they like as long as well actually as far as the deviations it probably be their bottoms because they are starting to grow different mm -hmm. one of them growing and faster they're, than the other and their color as far as what they tend to like they kind of gravitate more towards their pants being the color that they like more so than worried about their shirt. They just want their cut. They just want their pants red and blue. <laughs> okay, oh, where did you go? Oh. That burrito, it was good. I had to put the butter on it. Well, thank you, Firebirds. Come on. I put the bread on there. When I, when I had the utensils, it said uh, bread, Bread, yes or no, utensils, yes or no. How much it cost the bread? Free. Oh. No, I'm saying I didn't even know they had bread. You didn't remember. Mm-hmm. You knew you just didn't remember what I'm saying. We got bread from them before? Mm-hmm. I don't remember. That's mama. Okay. It was good though, even without that butter. Mm -hmm. I mean, it, it tastes real. But it is. I like it made fresh daily. Mm-hmm. Like a big hook. What's it mean? We hate to run. But if y'all want to catch us with dessert, we gotta go. Yes. Because we got to finish our errands. So we hope you guys enjoyed this video. We stay love safe, stay blessed. With that light Period. for someone else to emulate because you never know what your kind words and gestures could do for the next person. Period. Period. Well, like that custom service representative at USA that pretty much you take <laughs> away from auto insurance there. Mm -hmm.